you have are they giving you the communions all right can you lift up the communion in your hand the one you brought it is called the cup of the blessing and we have now seen tonight that the cup of the blessing also means the cup of preservation the cup of defense destroy it not for a blessing is in it i prophesy tonight in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy ghost this communion cup the communion wine and the communion bread in your hand is declared decreed announced and pronounced as the blessing of preservation in the name of jesus as you take this communion tonight the seal of preservation by the blessing is placed upon your life by the virtue of this communion the fear of the lord the dread of the lord the terror of the lord shall be established around your life in the name of jesus by the reason of this communion i declare the hedge of divine protection the shield of divine protection established around your life in the name of jesus by the reason of this communion every devil looking for you every witch looking for you every wizard looking for you shall receive the rebuke of the lord they shall hear the rebuke of the lord in the name of jesus by this cup of the blessing the angels of the blessing the angels of preservation shall be located and positioned and established around your life in the name of jesus by this cup of the blessing anyone who won't let you rest shall see the physical visitation the physical confrontation of jehovah on them in their dreams of the night in the name of jesus so shall it be i call it done in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy ghost and so it is everything in your body that is looking for your life by this communion it is flushed out every this demon of diabetes hypertension cancer peptic ulcer disease hiv hepatitis kidney disease liver disease lung disease heart disease brain disease musculoskeletal system disease every nerve condition every witchcraft deposit every unclean marine water spirit deposit every serpent spirit deposit everything in your body trying to threaten your life threaten your health trying to cut you short by the reason of this communion of the blood of jesus they are flushed out of your system you shall fulfill your day you shall fulfill your day you shall fulfill your day so shall it be in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy ghost by this communion tonight your blood is no longer drinkable by any devil neither the blood of your loved ones and relations by this communion tonight you won't be a victim of stray bullet you won't be a victim of sudden death sudden arrows and missiles that are fired back to sender so shall it be in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy ghost so shall it be before i stepped into the service the lord showed me a fiction of someone with all i saw was sores like cycle cycle round all over the legs everywhere i don't know if it is physical or is spiritual but it was caused by the climatic situation 
the environmental situation, the, the family background situation of that person. Whatever that represents in anybody's life, today it is flushed out forever. It is flushed out forever. Anything you drank in the dream, any injection, any exchange in the, in the night that has put any trouble in your system, today they are flushed right now. I caused diseases of the prostate, urinary system diseases, your tenure expires. So shall it be. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost, shout the loudest amen, amen. hallelujah does this something happen to someone now take up that communion eat it in the name of the father it's your communion of escape and your preservation and then blast in tongues Shaka -baka. Any enemy sire Love of all the day Your name is Jesus Your name is Lord Mahashaba Gadagalaya Stretch your two hands in front of you I prophesy upon your hands this month of blessing and prosperity in the greater glory shall favor you. Resources from the north, south, east, west shall look for you. So shall it be in Jesus' name. He suffered no man to do them wrong. He rebuked kings for their sake, saying, Touch not mine anointed, and do my prophets no harm. By the reason of this oil, I declare seal of divine preservation on your head. I decree today in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost, every agenda of the enemy regarding you your family your destiny is arrested you shall live you shall fulfill your days by the reason of this anointing you are confirmed untouchable 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 anywhere they call you inside a mirror Call you inside their water, call you in, in any realm. What they will see is fire. They will see fire. So shall it be in Jesus' name. Take a little of that oil in your hand. Hallelujah, my shadow. Please. As if in the, of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, I am sealed, I am sealed by, the by the anointing of the Holy Ghost, the Holy Ghost. with the blessing, with the blessing of, the Lord, of the Lord. I am indestructible by the anointing of the Holy Spirit, by the seal of the Lord. I am indestructible. I am indestructible. Lift the hands higher, Father. Let your fire flow, let your power flow, let your anointing flow. Let your grace flow. Let preservation flow. At the count of seven, you place the hand on your head and shout, I am blessed. I am blessed. And that blessing carries your preservation. Father, let the blessing that preserves be released now. At the count of seven, 
where you again one two three four five six seven i am blessed and then blasting tongues in the name of jesus one two three four five six and seven i am blessed receive the blessing receive the blessing The seal of the blessing. The seal of the blessing. The seal of the blessing. You are blessed. You are blessed. You are blessed. You are preserved by the fire. In Jesus. Precious name. Lift up your hands. You are blessed. You remain blessed. You are blessed. And you remain blessed. That's right. Every deposit of hell in your body is uprooted and sent back to hell. Someone here, the Lord said to you, you will not labor in vain. You will not bring forth for trouble. He said to someone, you are in your season of harvest right now. All the years that the canker worm, the caterpillar, the locust, ate in your life, is being released back to you. devil that steals your things every time something that is about to click is diverted you keep having your things missing things lost getting lost around you that devil is under arrest right now in the name of Jesus in your life there shall be no loss in somebody's dream tonight God will show you the thief that shall be caught. That's right. In somebody's dream tonight, God will take the veil off the face of someone who has been using another person's face to attack him. He will leave the veil. Tonight, a mystery shall be exposed. You shall see the source of your affliction, the source of your trouble. And you shall receive the answer. Shout the loudest, Amen. When it happens, will you testify? You will testify. Your dream life is changing after tonight. From dreams of oppression and affliction and pursuit to dreams of victory that will translate into the physical. And for Nigeria, we decree. It is well with our land. It is well with the nation. The agenda of the devil for this nation is arrested. Go forth and break forth. Return back with your testimony.